My name is Stephanie Price and I'm an application sales engineer with Crosby. Welcome to another edition of Ask the Expert. Today we will be answering a question that was submitted anonymously. The question, I've noticed many crane hooks and shackles have marks indicating 45 degree angle from the direction of lift. What is the purpose of these marks? Do they relate to the rule or limit for sling angles? Thank you for your question. The markings on the Crosby hooks and shackles are an essential tool and have several uses. Let's take a minute to review the meanings of these markings. The angle indicator markings you have seen on the Crosby hooks and shackles are an essential part of Crosby's patented quick check system. These marks were developed to assist rigging personnel in the field with several rigging requirements. That is to say angle of loading. There are many ASME standards concerning the effects of sling angle on hardware and hooks. ASME B30.9 for slings, ASME B30.10 for hooks, ASME B30.26 for hardware. In 1992, the quick check system was patented by Crosby to enhance the safe and proper use of Crosby products. The minimum horizontal sling angle when slings are placed directly into the hooks is 45 degrees. You may use Crosby shackles as a collector ring when it is oriented so that the pin is up and the bow is down. When applying a single line load to a shackle that is at any angle greater than 10% off of the normal plane of loading or inline, there is working load limit reduction percentages that shall be followed dependent on how large that angle is. That angle can go beyond 45 degree quick check marks all the way up to 90 degrees, which is completely side loaded. But the reduction in working load limit shall be followed according to the side loaded rating reduction table and the application information of the Crosby catalog. Please note that round pin shackles should never be side loaded. You can find this and much more application information by visiting our website at www.thecrosbygroup.com. Thank you for the question, and we'll see you next time on Ask the Expert. Yeah.